All right, so uh, let's start talking about Python. Okay, so we first of all will discuss that this Python is a very high-level object-oriented interpreted programming language. Okay, and it has garnered the worldwide attention as we all know, right? So and it is like in the top three orders, right? पहले तीन में आता है जैसे first, second या third languages most languages अगर आप search करें तो Python आपको मिल ही जाएगा. Top three or five, may you will going to get it, okay? And Stack Overflow has uh, say that it has uh, mainly users like thirty eight point eight percent something around use Python for their projects, okay? Uh, just a second. Hmm. So uh, Python's popularity has surpassed uh, the C plus plus and the C sharps and like in the Java's also. In 2018 itself, okay, and okay. So uh, let's go ahead and talk about this, right? What are the features? What exactly the language works? How it works and all. Okay, so we'll be learning what is Python, why it is popular, what are the features, where in the industries these are used, language is being used, what should be the learning path for our uh, course, and what all are the career opportunities you can use. One. Okay. Okay, next. So, in very simple words, I would say that this is a very high-level dynamic programming language which is interpreted. Interpreted and compiler का difference आप लोगों को पता है? Yeah. Anyone who don't know the difference between interpreter and compiler, कितनों को पता है? Yes, sir, पता है. बताऊँ sir. बताओ बताओ इंटरप्रेटर मतलब जैसे जैसे मैंने कोई भी कोड की पहली लाइन लिखी है तो वो पहले उसे रीड करेगा उसे एक्सेक्यूट करेगा तो अगर मुझे पहली लाइन में कोई एरर आ रहा है तो बता देगा पर जो कंपाइलर होगा वो सबको इकट्ठे ही कंपाइल कर देगा और फिर मुझे फाइनल रिजल्ट देगा आपकी पूरी कोड एक बार कंपाइल होगी और ये आप बोल सकते हैं मशीन लैंग्वेज में कोड होगी ठीक है और उसके बाद आपको आउटपुट मिलेगी एंड इंटरप्रेटेड में आप एक लाइन लिखोगे या आप दो लाइन लिखोगे तो फर्स्ट लाइन जो है एक के बाद एक इंटरप्रेट या आप बोल सकते हो मशीन लैंग्वेज में टर्न होने के बाद आपको आउटपुट मिलेगा ओके दैट इज अ डिफरेंस बिटवीन दोज थिंग्स ओके एंड दिस इट इज वेरी Interpreted language, okay. In very simple language, we can say this is an interpreted language, okay. So Van Rossum sir has uh, you know created this Python language. He can also be known as the father of Python, and he has very simple goals in his mind when he was uh, developing this. Like, जब वो बना रहे थे तो very simple goals he was having. Like, it should be easy looking, okay. The program should be easy looking and Easy, readable, and it should be an open source. So we use कर सकें, okay? And this is currently like most used language. You can say and most preferred language to work because of its simplicity. We'll be going ahead with the features, libraries, readabilities, and all. Okay. So like if you have been a school coder, you may be completely new to this programming. If you are, then it is the best way to get us started with the things. Okay. All right. So why it is popular? We have some of the features. Which features are you seeing here? Okay. Less code, pre-built libraries, ease of learnings. Okay. And platform independent, massive support, community. All right. So what is the first features? What you can see here is Python is the language which is preferred by the beginners and the pros. Pros is nothing but the professionals, or you can say the in the office. Okay. In some big companies, in some projects where the professionals of Python, uh, we can say, um, program is used, right? So this is the very first feature. Then it is an open source platform, or you can say the language, which make it free for everyone to use. And we'll be discussing about this OOS, oh sorry, OSL, okay? Which is kind of a floss. Floss definition or uh, full form anyone know? Floss का मतलब पता है? किसी को पता है क्या? Floss का meaning? Okay. 
I think it is just an open source software, but you have to like definition pata hona chahiye. Free library, open source software. Okay. All right. Uh, next, you can see Python can be used for desktop, web, mobile application developments. Okay, and you can access your codes from the web, from the uh, PCs, and uh, even with the mobiles. Right. Next, communities are very quite big, and libraries are a lot of things. So there, you also saw in the Anaconda too, right? And libraries are something like uh, we would be learning one library like uh, pandas one okay which will be helpful for your project over there so it makes things very simpler right like if a library is uh, giving you an options to search for a prime number and not a prime number or selective of the prime numbers in the ranges using uh, without using the loops so use kar sakte hain libraries okay all right, uh, let's go with the features just a second. Yeah, so the very first feature, let's talk about this, okay? Simplicity. So simplicity, you can say like, uh, you have to think very less of the syntax of the language and you have to think more for the codes, nothing much, right? So syntax, ko lekar aapko jada dhyan nahi dena hai, right? It is very simpler and very easy language so there is no such difficulties in writing such uh, things over there like in very normal common language how you write you just declare the things so right okay next coming as huh? the open source yeah indentation error indentation error indentations error kis liye hoti hai dekho loops aap agar use kar rahe ho ya aap जैसे कुछ भी प्रोग्राम लिख रहे हो जिसमें इंडेंटेशन इंडेंटेशन का यही प्रॉब्लम होता है कि आप जैसे कोलम दे दिए ठीक है उसके बाद आपको फाइव स्पेसेस नेसेसरी हैं ओके फाइव स्पेसेस या आप बोलो उसको वन टैब ओके अगर वो नहीं रहती है ना तो प्रॉब्लम ये होता है कि लाइंस मशीन को लाइन्स रीड करने में प्रॉब्लम होता है कि कोई लाइन लूप के बाहर है या लूप के अंदर है ओके okay? इस वजह से एरर आता है समझ रहे Yes, sir. I'll show you one code after this PPT, then you'll understand. Someone is asking for the meeting link in the group. Anshul is there. Anshul, are you here? Yeah. Yes, I'm here. Okay. Link will be same for your class, okay? Yeah, I realize that. Sorry. No problem. Okay. Uh, next is, okay. I think open source is not defined, right? So open source is nothing like uh, we can say any powerful language. Uh, which is actually powerful and it's very uh, useful can be considered as an open source once for like it could be free for everyone to use as an alter needed okay uh, next coming as portabilities now python code can be shared and it would work in the same way as it was intended to like seamless and hassle free right so aap koi codes likh rahe hain theek hai aapne koi c mein code likha hua hai aapne c++ mein koi code likha hua hai usko convert karke aap python mein read karna chahte hain aapne python mein likhne ke baad aapne csv html excel mein convert karna hai to that is also possible right so portabilities are there next is embedded and extensible right so python have uh, can have the snippets of other languages what i just said right and inside it to perform some certain functions so that is your embedded and extensible interpreter to aap samajh gaye kya hota hai the worries of large memory task aap jo bhi likhte ho and heavy cpu jo interpretations and compilations mein jo hota hai right and so cpu tasks are being taken care of the python okay so aapko codes ke bare mein zyada dikkat nahi hai aapne agar galat likha bhi hai to next line mein you will get an error that there is some kind of issues right it could be type error in uh file error name errors anything okay next libraries again is there no class someone in the group is there asking for the class please tell him that the link is same anyone please write in the group thank you So libraries uh, 
okay in libraries uh, help you much when you are going through data science okay uh, web development and just a minute here yes. kunal verma So we'll be covering some of, as you can see, like if I zoom it, if it is possible, any, no. So what you can see there is something sci-fi, matplotlib, pandas, um, and let me add with him. Then the numpy, okay. So these are some of the important libraries what can be used, matplotlib, seaborn, scikit-image, learns and all, okay. So like sci-fi use for your mathematics part, numpy use for numerical mathematics, okay? Scientific mathematics for your sci-fi, then computational mathematics, okay? The science and all used in the simpy, then for the data sets and all, you use pandas, plotting it's in matplotlib. Again, in the higher version, if you want to plot it, you use Seaborn. And if you want to use machine learnings and all, we use scikit-learn. So rest things are there like libraries, okay? And next coming on to be OOPs uh, for the object oriented programmings. And these objects basically whatever language you are learning this object oriented programming is used right for the privacy securities and all. So this is the important part of the language. And also I have shared you a book for this right so you can go through that too. Okay. So objects help breaking down complex uh, real life problems into like such a way that they can be coded and also can be solved to obtain some solutions. Okay, so that is your oops. Next coming up, like where Python is used in the industries and how it is being used. Okay, so things are there like in Google, better search results are provided based on the ranking of websites and much more. Like how it is done, Let's say you search for anything in the web, like in the Google browser, you just go on and search for Python, right? What will be the first website you would be looking on? Python.org, obviously, because it is the official one and also the most visited website for the Python, right? Then after you might be getting some different results from different links and all as the most visited ones, okay? So that is called as your ranking. And this, uh, when you search for Python, that Python keyword will be uh, searched all over the, uh, you can say the websites which is present in the Google servers. Okay, so that is how it be searched. Next in the Dropbox, same case, the servers in the client applications are coded. Okay, like upload some things, download some things like in the Google Drive. Okay. Next is the Netflix. Now this, uh, uh, you can say this uh, example of the Netflix can be used also for Amazon, any shopping e-commerce websites or any shopping, whatever you use where the user's attraction is important. Okay, right? So how it is going to be used? Like once you install any such applications and register right so what is asked uh, what it asks to you that is uh, choose some three of the your interest something any right movies albums anything and uh, when you are in the e-commerce website then what you say that you have signed in with your application you have signed in with your application and then you have signed in with your choice because you want to do shopping or whatever so you search for anything right and next time what happens if you have noticed that next time when you go to the app after closing it it will give you similar searches on the basis of that right is the netflix what happens aapne jaise three interest aapke interest ki movies aapne select kar li right so kya hoga next time not next time also it will take some seconds okay and based on the genres and the moods what you have taken for the movies based on some features what it will do, it will use the algorithm of clustering that is a part of a machine learning unsupervised learning. Okay. And from that feature, what it will do, it a cluster, a group banayega ke liye, okay? O kuch movies ke, and that is like enough of that. Okay. 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 All right. So like if I give an example for 
a basic example and let's say there are students of uh, there are a class of uh, 60 students okay so some like sir, hello sir yeah hello sir aap hindi mein samjha do sir samajh nahi aa raha bilkul bhi kuch okay all right uh, koi problem nahi theek to maine ye kaha ki jaise aap uh, ek simple sa example lo ki ek 60 student uh, students ka class hai okay and karna ye hai aapko ki uh, कुछ 60 स्टूडेंट्स में किसी को क्रिकेट खेलना पसंद है किसी को फुटबॉल पसंद है बैडमिंटन एंड समथिंग समथिंग लाइक दैट ओके सो हम क्या करेंगे कुछ 10 स्टूडेंट्स या जिनको पसंद है उनका एक ग्रुप बनाएंगे है ना तो उनके इंटरेस्ट के बेसिस पे हम ग्रुप बनाएं वैसे ही नेटफ्लिक्स में क्या होता है कि आप साइन इन किए ओके एंड उसके बाद फिर आपके पास ऑप्शंस आएंगे नहीं होता तो आप एक बार साइन इन करके देखना ठीक है तो आपके पास ऑप्शंस आएंगे क्या कि आप अपने इंटरेस्ट के कुछ मूवीज सिलेक्ट करें जैसे कि आप आ, कोई भी म्यूजिक ऐप भी डाउनलोड कर लो तो भी आपको आप ऑप्शंस आते हैं ना हिंदी में सुनना है इंग्लिश में सुनना है या आपके सिंगर्स का ज्यादा पसंद है राइट सो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ योर सिलेक्शन ये क्या करेगा ये ग्रुप बना देगा एंड फिर आपको वही मूवीज शो शो किया जाएगा जो आपने सिलेक्ट किया था या जिस पे लाइक like, आपने किसी आपने स्टार्टिंग में कोई तीन हॉरर मूवी सिलेक्ट कर लिए तो ऑब्वियसली आपके जो होम पेज होगा ठीक है नेटफ्लिक्स का सारे के सारे आपके मूवीज या शोज या जो भी होंगे एपिसोड सब रिलेटेड टू एट मोस्ट रिलेटेड टू योर हॉरर्स होंगे ठीक है एंड फिर उसके बाद आप किसी और पे भी अगर जाते हैं तो उस बेसिस पे मतलब आपका जो इंटरेस्ट होगा उसके अकॉर्डिंगली इट वर्क्स राइट सो यूजर्स लंबे समय तक रहे कंपनी से एसोसिएटेड इसलिए राइट सो दैट इज अ पार्ट ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग अभी समझ में आया सबको सो सर जैसे मैंने ना कुछ जैसे Amazon पे कुछ सर्च किया तो मुझे बाकी सारी सोशल साइट्स पर वही चीज शो होने लग जाती है तो ये भी काम फिर पाइथन का ही है हां ये भी उसी चीज की है इसी को आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस भी बोलते हैं ओके सो लाइक आपने कुछ सर्च किया अभी क्या होता है कि आपने मान लो लैपटॉप सर्च कर लिया Amazon पे ठीक है फर्स्ट टाइम आपने साइन इन किया आपने सर्च कर लिया नेक्स्ट टाइम क्या होगा आप वापस से अमेजन पे जाओगे और देखोगे आपके होम पेज में लैपटॉप ढेर सारे लैपटॉप के अपने आप दिखाएंगे ठीक है फिर लैपटॉप के एक्सेसरीज हो गया जैसे जो भी हो गया केस हो गया कीबोर्ड्स हो गया रिलेटेड टू लैपटॉप्स फिर आपको कुछ-कुछ दिखाते रहेंगे फिर आप गूगल पर जाओ कुछ सर्च करो साइड में एड्स आ जाएंगे वो भी उसी से रिलेटेड होंगे राइट सो दीस आर नथिंग बट लाइक व्हाटएवर यू सर्च और ये सब डेटास होती है एक्चुअली व्हाट एवर यू सर्च दैट इज अ डेटा राइट सो एंड दैट डेटास आर बीइंग ट्रांसफर्ड टू कंपनीज टू कंपनीज सो उसी बेसिस पे होता है ओके सिलेक्शंस होते हैं कुछ नहीं तो आप देखो आप अभी आप ट्रेनिंग अटेंड कर रहे हो आपको कैसे पता चला आपने नेट पे देखा होगा या आपके पास Instagram Facebook पर आया हुआ होगा है ना तो वो ऐसे ही आता है जैसे आपने इट हैज बीन सेट लाइक एन एजेस फॉर लाइक 25 टू सॉरी 18 to 25, 26, something age, आप बोल दो, select कर लो, फिर interest पे जाएंगे हम, तो हम क्या कर रहे हैं, हम users के interest check कर रहे हैं, right? तो अगर आपको इस Python में interest है, तो क्यों होगा, किसी, अब हम क्या रहे हैं कि 20 years का एक student होगा, या 20 years का कोई भी बच्चा है, तो उसको Python में कैसे interest होगा, if he is interested in something AI, if he is searching for any machine learning thing in Instagram, अगर उसको कंप्यूटर uh, साइंस में इंटरेस्ट है सो देयर आर वेरियस काइंड ऑफ यू कैन से पैरामीटर्स एंड इन सब बेसिस पे ही तो एड्स बनते हैं ठीक है थीके? और वो एड्स में भी फिर यही सब चीजें लगती हैं तो समझ में आ गया होगा सबको आगे बढ़ते हैं नेक्स्ट इज एनएसए राइट सो एनक्रिप्शन एंड डिक्रिप्शन अब आपने व्हाट्सएप कभी खोल के देखा होगा टॉप में एकदम लिखा रहता है चैट्स आर बीइंग एनक्रिप्टेड लिखा रहता है ना राइट सो बेसिकली होता ये कि अब हमने कोई कोड लिखा हम आगे सीखेंगे रैंडम फीचर्स तो बताऊंगा कैसे करते हैं ओके सो मान लो कि आपने कुछ मैसेज लिखा राइट एंड ये क्लाइंट इज गिविंग सम मैसेज टू सम अदर क्लाइंट राइट एंड इन द मिडिल यू हैव अ सर्वर राइट सो क्या होगा आपने कोई मैसेज भेजा और उधर मैसेज पहुंचने से पहले बीच में कोई ना के पढ़ ले मैसेज दैट इज कॉल्ड एज लाइक फिशिंग थिंग्स नो सॉरी नॉट फिशिंग uh what exactly it is called as a hacking is something hmm, some kind of sql injections and all okay so beech mein aake message padhna right that is a work of hackers so ye na ho isliye kya karte encryption and decryptions hote hain matlab aapka code wahan pahunchte hi decode hoga usse pehle nahi hona chahiye right 
so that is encryption and nothing much like if you are thinking like your messages are secure that is not secure okay so it is not like no one can read right that is the only thing that is used for decodings and codings that has gotten a different name that is encryptions and decryptions otherwise uh, messages can be read easily not easily so, you can say but can be but, read but nsa uses it for their own purpose and they use this for python so python has a lot of things right you can use djangos with that you can use frameworks for web development ha huh, uh, anyone is trying to ask something so but uh, the web, whatsapp claims that it is secured and we can share to a third party hmm so what if it is not claiming it has to claim actually see it is secure it is not like it is not very much secure it is secure but uh, you can say not uh, what should you say so i about that uh, whatsapp has said that most of the data which get leaked that are due to the backup that is the only process of leaking hmm those who backup their data is in the google then hmm. from there the data is otherwise there is no process they claim see so that everyone does actually right everyone backups their data most of the users like if you are changing your mobile applications right obviously you need your chats from that to that phone obviously you will be keeping a backup i also keep it right but that is not an issue of keeping it an as a backup is uh, is insecure right because your hacking to the google drive is not possible right that is very much secure that we can say so but uh, you said that it is uh, encryption and decryption is done by python but uh, when we log in when you make in web whatsapp login, decryption make... i am not saying see whatsapp one i am not saying i am saying nsa uses uh, this with python i am uh, making you understand that the uh, meaning of encryption and decryption in whatsapp what it happens okay no, so i am not saying in whatsapp in any other things any other encryption like password encryption or any other thing we use php we can use mm mm-hmm. mhm we can use php or any other language mm. so like you are asking that you would be using php no so i am asking that while i have developed a website there i have used php to encrypt my passwords mm. users password those who log in on my site mm. so that is that php is also mm. used in encryption and decryption yeah see languages every language can be used for encryption that is only why we are learning oop in all different other language in c you have ops in c++ you have you c sharp you have in java you have this oop is nothing but the privacy and security factors okay ye jitna sharp hoga utna acha aapke language honge so i have a doubt yeah ask for example if i want to create an app or an website can we use multiple languages uh sorry what do you ask If we, for example, any if we want to create a website or an app, hmm. can, uh, is it necessary to use only one language, no, or no, you can no, use no. various languages to you can use create a website? Language. You can use it. Okay. But the problem would be that if any small error also occurs, right? So you have to see in which part, in which language you have coded that one, and then you have to settle it down in that language. Okay. but in python what happens it is easily as you saw that codes portabilities are there so other language can be used not only with python there are lot of language also there so mostly different different language are combined sometimes to make your websites okay all right getting ahead now next in the bittorrent what happens transfer of files when you download something anyone has downloaded anything from bittorrent you might have seen some peers files lot of things being downloaded okay just a minute just a minute Oh. Mhm. Hmm. Hmm. Mhm. Mm-hmm.
okay uh, next in the nasas the scientific calculation nothing but psi p's and all okay and rest of the things are being used so what should be the learning path let's discuss okay where to start and so with the basics we'll be going on next would be the variables then the data types and operators arrays and the flow controls the methods and as i said file handlings and the ops practice right so ops i have shared to you as a book also you can go through that all right okay next going on Next, going to the career opportunities. Okay, now you can work as a software developer. You can work as an AI engineer, ML engineer, in AI data science fields and web testing using Selenium's. Then big data's, game developments, frameworks, and all. Okay, data scientist, which is the most popular job for now. Okay, so yes, you can use this. Experience is a very important thing you should have. And Python, like or in any job, what you are doing, right? Experience is most important. So in India, uh, the developer earns around 500k approximately. Okay, as compared to US as 88 dollars. Sorry, 88 thousand dollars. Okay. So an average salary is around 5 lakh 10. Okay, that is a per year one. And in the US also, as you can see, I have shared the PPTs. You can go through it, right? Then the next thing after experience, you would be having it as a location. Now, even though you are having a very good experience, if you are not working in a good location, then you might face some of the difficulties, right? According to your experience, you should work on a good locations too, right? So in India, if you talk about Gurgaon, Bangalore, New Delhi, Mumbai, Pune, best areas to work on, okay? All right, after this experience and this location, what extra, like if we say that, if we are a student, right? And if you are uh, having, you know, like, uh, if, uh, you can say like, if you have just passed the class 12 right now, okay? So you might have got very good percentage, okay? So we can say that you have some good experience or you can have some good uh, percentages, okay? And locations, or you can say you have also passed from a very good school, all right, or a college. Hmm? So the most important thing is the next one that is your skill set. What other things you know except from the things you have learned from your college or the schools, right? So that is called as a skill set. Now nowadays AWS, Django's are the most important one which is going through, right? So if you are a Python developer, the skills what you need is like if you also know machine learning, cloud computing with AWS, that's all. It's very important. Okay. So that is also a good thing if you learn that skills are very important okay so uh, let's proceed with the things right and let's open the Jupiter and start the things let me open it so I hope everyone is having Jupiter किसी ने तो इंस्टॉल करना था ना उस दिन इंस्टॉल हो गया सर इंस्टॉल तो हो गया अभी चला के नहीं देखा हूं अभी देखूंगा टेस्ट कर लो एक बार सर अगर बाय चांस ना चला तो पाइजाम में कर दूं फिर हम्म हम्म नो इशू
सर पीएस कोड भी यूज कर सकते हैं इसकी जगह हम्म कर सकते हैं प्रॉब्लम नहीं है कुछ भी यूज करने में बस कोड सर होने चाहिए today's date for you can see the screen yes sir so it's 21 and some basics so that's all we'll be going with the basics very basics uh, i'll be just telling you how to run the codes and all for today hmm yes, that's the introduction part okay all right and so jupiter sabke paas hai bhi right i hope hmm? and what all these are the features what all here it is and what would be the working of these drop downs All right. Okay. I think it should come down. It's not coming. Okay. So uh, I have Python. Python. So how to open Jupiter? Uh, Python. You are having. I think I have to share the full screen. Just a minute. Okay, you're having Python. So do one thing. Uh, you can open your new scratch file. All right, and then just go down and select Python. So new scratch file has been selected. Okay, and then you can write a few codes here. here. Let me zoom in. So I'm telling you both and. The scratch and anaconda. Don't know me some chat room. Okay. Codes will be same. Just you have to change the running times. Hmm. So what you can see here, one is your line number. Hmm. किसके जुपिटर में ये वन दिख रहे हैं अभी आपको जुपिटर खोल लिया सबने Anyone having problem? Yes, I can't see the one written. Hmm. No, okay, no problem. Just a minute. हम्म, सो हाउ मेनी कैन सी दिस कितनों को नहीं दिख रहा वन लिखा हुआ अपने स्क्रीन पे मेरे स्क्रीन पे नहीं मतलब यू कैन सी माय वन बट चेक योर जुपिटर एंड टेल मी हाउ ऑफ हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू कैन सी दिस जस्ट अ मिनट आई कैन सी वन ओके एंड अंशुला सेड आई थिंक राइट सो टू Anyone else? Everyone can see. And जो पाई चाम यूज कर रहे हैं उनको तो ऑब्वियसली दिखता होगा वन यहाँ पे इंस्टॉलिंग ओके राइट आई सेव इट टू इंस्टॉल इट प्रीवियसली नो प्रॉब्लम 
It's the basics we'll be going to do. That's not an issue. राइट सो बाकी सबको दिख रहा है क्या एक बार बता दो जल्दी जल्दी दिशाना कृतिका कुणाल अंकित प्रीति नीलिमा प्रणव जो आपने तो भाई चाम आपका खुला क्या ये जुपिटर खुल गया क्या आपका जाप Okay, see, for those who can't see this one, do one thing. Press escape plus L. Or once press escape and then press L. So, see, I'm saying how to press. Uh, I'm going to open it. नहीं सर हो नहीं रहा मेरा ना गुंडा में जुपिटर नहीं खुल रहा छोड़ दो फिर पाई चाम में ये सब ओके फॉर द रेस्ट डू वंस विथ मी एंड टेल मी दैट इफ इट इज वर्किंग और नॉट बिकॉज़ एस्केप फंक्शंस यू हैव टू लर्न इन बेटर राइट सो एस्केप एंड एल इफ यू राइट इट फॉर टू टाइम्स इफ यू प्रेस इट फॉर yeah, so L would L is nothing but the line numbers. So if I say this is line one, sorry, line one, line two, line three, so it would be like in the same way. And if I again write this, lines would be removed, right? But this is not in case of the pi charm. Like this it goes, okay. No issues understood how line works. No, why I'm preferring uh, Jupiter is like you can make notes here. How see now, if we come here in the drop down section, you will find code. Now, whenever it is code, jab bhi a code likha hoga. आपने जो भी लिखना है यहाँ लाइक टू प्लस थ्री टू इक्वल्स टू थ्री समथिंग लाइक दैट टू इक्वल इक्वल्स टू थ्री जो भी आप यूज़ कर रहे हो ओके व्हाट एवर द कोर्स वुड बी सो ये आपका रनिंग मोड में होगा राइट दैट इज स्टिल यू कैन सी एनीथिंग हेड इन द बॉक्स दैट इज नो कोड्स हैज बीन गिवन एज एन इनपुट टिल नाउ सो वन आई राइट दिस दैट टू प्लस थ्री सो आई रन दिस फॉर रनिंग वॉट यू हैव टू डू इज you have to press shift plus enter okay so can we just press the run option above hmm or you can just press the run one right so like s tishana from which patch she is Sir, I was opening it in laptop. Okay, please. Okay. Just a second. Yeah, anyone if it is joining from two sides, just tell me because I have to check it. Yeah, I'm a data science student, so I'll be coming then. So this is done. Shift plus enter. So two plus three. Very quick enter. Output five. This was the input one. Output one you have got right. Three minus four. Run. Output two. And input two. Clear to everyone. Line numbers are also there. If I remove the line numbers. 
don't be confused hmm okay same in the pie charm how it works and right 2 minus 3 but here what you have to do is you have to write some things like uh, what you actually want of 2 minus 3 so we want the output for 2 minus 3 that is we want to print the value for 2 minus 3 so we have to write the print function print and this brackets are called as parentheses okay so inside this print we'll be writing 2 minus 3 and then run so don't use shift plus enter here you can use this one run this run just a minute what is an issue process some minutes so I run this and now put minus one I guess you can see it right minus one is your output and same way you can write up the things like print three plus four and run that and you'll be getting the output for that okay so like in that sense you would be getting here like you have to use the print function but not every time in the Jupyter because it will work so that's why I was preferring you for this uh, you can use this and also in the Kaggle and you can also use it in the uh, you know like the collabs okay google collab so once you open this collab see uh zap if it is not uh, working in anaconda you can use google collab all right open that and the guys who cannot use this uh, this jupiter can use this collab in the same way but you have to do some changes there like new notebooks if you are using you have to write like new notebook okay and yeah. this would come here okay uh, next what you have to do is let it open so I understood how PyCharm works okay uh, coming to the Jupyter one you see some files you have options here to make a copy save as some other versions if you click on save as if not in the IP might be then in other versions okay and then print previews are there like if you want to print this you can print you can save in the PDF formats as like this of your basics and you can save the uh, PDF of that whatever you have uh, done in the class all right or whatever there is your questions like that uh, next coming up here uh, you can download it in HTML format MD formats PDF by slides HTMLs and all I think it has been open now all right so you can see the collab now right uh, let me make it maximize hmm. and uh, hmm, fine so you have to go to the runtime for now you guys don't have to make it but change the runtime to gpu okay and save it so these are being saved somewhere you can see the folders it is connecting a runtime to enable the file browsing. Okay, then you can see that your file is safe. Okay, so it is just allocating right now. Uh, hello, sir. Hello. Yes, sir. Please zoom it. Uh, I cannot see. What are you doing? Uh, 
what you haven't understood uh this one uh, uh, now what are you doing and now uh, just now what you changed uh, from file from that part i have not seen run time run time i just yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. and my con- my connection is uh, getting problem i am co- connected uh, lost okay uh, see from run time you have to go to change run time type Okay, click on this. Okay, wait. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Then click on the GPU one. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. That's it. Hmm. So done. Okay. Uh, next, nothing you have to do. That's it. So like here also, guys. Uh, if I'm writing something two minus three, I'll be writing it. Uh, let me zoom here. Okay. And uh, for running, you can use this one, and or else shift plus enter would be giving you the output. This is minus one, right? Four plus five. Same things. Okay. Coming back to this Jupiter, now the this route down, okay? It is the code. ये आपको समझ में आ गया होगा, okay? अभी मैं इसको change करके mark down कर दूँ. Or if I change it to heading, mark downs and heading have the same workings, okay? Uh, what is the use? See, आपको कुछ heading डालना हो, जैसे मैंने यहाँ पे लिखा bold में basics of Python, right? So मैंने use क्या किया यहाँ पर mark down, जैसा कि आप देख सकते हैं. मैं यहाँ पे नीचे किया तो कोड है एंड अपवर्ड्स यू कैन सी एस दी मार्क डाउन राइट सो मार्क डाउन या हेडिंग आप कुछ भी यूज करें वो किस लिए यूज होने वाला है हेडिंग्स देने के लिए राइट सो दैट इज द मेन पर्पस फॉर दैट लाइक लेट्स से इफ आई एम सेइंग सब ट्रैक्शंस और इफ आई से मल्टीप्लीकेशन मैंने लिख दिया मल्टीप्लीकेशन मैंने दिस रैंड ओके रनिंग सेम है शिफ्ट प्लस एंटर ओके सो ये आपको क्या दिख रहा है डिफरेंट इन सम टाइप्स ऑफ दिस बेसिक्स ऑफ पाथन एंड इन सब में बोल्डनेस का डिफरेंस है राइट सो इसको अगर बोल्ड लेटर्स में लिखना है क्या करना पड़ेगा सबसे पहली बात तो बोल्ड लेटर्स में नेटवर्क इश्यूज हो रहे हैं क्या सबको हो रहा है क्या नेटवर्क इश्यूज आपकी साइड एक्चुअली आई एम हैविंग अ गुड वाई फाई आई थिंक एक बार आप रिज्वाइन कर लो शायद हो जाए ठीक ना मेरे नेट की स्पीड 150 फिफ्टी एम बी पी एस है सो नेटवर्क इशूज तो नहीं होंगे सो वट यू कैन डू टू मेक इट बोल्ड इज टू अंडर स्कोर इन द स्टार्टिंग टू अंडर स्कोर इन दी लास्ट ओके मच बोल्डर यू यू वॉन्ट दैट इज वॉन्ट टू मेक इट एन लार्ज यू कैन यूज हैश टैग्स वन हैश टैग गिव अ स्पेस the largest size would come okay two hashtags oh, where it is yeah two hashtags give us space second largest and like that it goes till six heading one you might have read in the html h1 to h6 sabko pata hoga so h6 tak jata hai sir all right and then yes uh, you have the headings like that okay so multiplications Like that. This how it is easy to work. Okay, ये हो गया. फिर आपने कोई कोड लिखा है, क्वेश्चन लिखा है, उसको आपको जैसे मैंने यहाँ पे लिख दिया. Something I'm making just a code or simple. Okay. So मैंने लिखा for i and range of twenty five. Friend i. So this is a code, right? अब मैंने एक कोड ये एग्जाम में दे दिया आप लोगों को मान लो, ठीक है? तो मैं ये चाह रहा हूँ कि इसकी आउटपुट क्या होगी आपको बताना है राइट यू हैव टू गिव द आउटपुट ऑफ दिस कोड सो कैसे दूंगा मैं ये ओके इफ आई प्रिंट दिस इफ आई रन दिस आई विल बी गेटिंग द आउटपुट राइट बट आई डोंट वांट द आउटपुट टू शो यू सो व्हाट आई कैन डू इज आई कैन राइट एस्केप आर आई कैन प्रेस एस्केप एन आर टू मेक इट इन रॉ एन बी कन्वर्ट एंड डोंट डेटा टाइप फर्स्ट लाइक हाउ डिट वर्क विदाउट असाइनिंग द डेटा टाइप 
That is why I say it, Python is simple. You don't have to assign it. Data types you don't have to assign here. It automatically detects the things. Okay, sir. And here you don't have to data type. क्या करना क्या है फॉर आई इन रेंज ऑफ 25 ठीक है एक 25 नंबर्स का आपके पास रेंज है बस आई को प्रिंट करना है और क्या है तो डेटा टाइप का तो यूज ही नहीं है समझ गए यस सर तो अभी मैंने क्वेश्चन देना तो मैंने ऐसे दूंगा ठीक है और फिर आप आउटपुट अभी बता सकते हो कितने आपको आउटपुट आने वाले कितने नंबर्स आने वाले हैं लाइक दैट ओके सो ये सब है ठीक है कैसे यूज करना है एंड किस तरह से आपको मार्क डाउन कोड्स एंड ऑल यूज करने ठीक है आपको कोड्स ऊपर नीचे करनी है तो कैसे करेंगे ये डाउन है डाउन एंड अप ठीक है कोड्स कॉपी कर लिए सेकंड में भी वही कोड चाहिए थोड़ा बहुत चेंजेस करना है यू कैन कॉपी डाउन एंड यू कैन हेयर यू कैन पेस्ट इट डाउन सिंपल एंड इसको अभी अब अब लाना है तो अब अब कर दिए राइट लाइक दैट कोड्स कट कर रहे हैं कट न्यू सेल लाना है या सर व्हाट डिड यू यूज्ड टू हाइड द आउटपुट Hide the output. Escape Hide. R. Escape R. Yeah, escape R. Okay, sir. Or uh, uh, you can from here you can select raw and convert. वो भी hide हो जाएगी. जैसे इसकी भी output अगर hide करनी है आपको raw and we convert. Hide. अगर code चाहिए तो code. Run it again. Output you will get. Okay. So ये सब थी आपको इस तरह से use करना है. ठीक है. Okay. So from tomorrow we'll be starting up with the uh, calculation parts and जो भी हमारा basics start होने वाला है operator से हम start करेंगे okay so ये सब use करेंगे कल से right तो तब तक जो नहीं use कर पा